Hey guys, all right, so I have some empties today. It's been a little while of me collecting these up and it is time to throw them away. So I'm gonna go ahead and make this video. I don't have a ton of different things, um, just a few hair care, a few body care, and that's it. So let's jump in. All right, this is the Annabelle's Perfect Blend Foaming Body Wash and I have it in Blueberry Cheesecake as well as Volcano Capri Blue. So I actually have several of these. I think I might have two or three more still on my shelf. I love them. The scents are all great. Annabelle's has a ton of scents, so you pretty much just pick your favorite, and that's all I can say about that. But this is a great body wash. It's cleansing. It feels really smooth on your skin. It leaves you feeling moist. So yeah, I really enjoy it. It's kind of like a treat <laughs> during your shower, so definitely love these. This is the Ateneo body wash. Um, I think I finished this one up quite a while ago. I loved the scent. It was very strong and kind of a tart scent too, but very, very good. Loved it. Um, yeah, this one gave me good moisture as well, so I would recommend it. If you haven't tried Ateneo's products, they are from Jamaica, so yeah. Here are a couple of the Dr. Bronner's Castile soaps. Yes, I absolutely love these. Let's see, so these each cost $6. $6, of course, I got them at Marshall's, um, and I was so happy to find them on that great reduced price sale, $6, you can't beat that. So I think I bought maybe like four or five, I don't know, how many did I get? Yeah, four or five of them um, in different scents, and I just love it. So I have these three large ones that I finished up here. Um, I don't know. So green tea was really good. I loved the scent of this one. Rose, that one was also good. Um, and the citrus, yes definitely the citrus one so I think actually the green tea and the citrus those two are my favorite scents but um, yeah I still have a few more to finish up and then I can let you know if I liked any other ones better but Castile soap you can't beat it it's very cleansing and just great 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 so have those also I have one more this is a smaller bottle of the Dr. Bronner's in Earl Grey so yeah, Earl Grey, I have never even seen that scent before, but I did pick this one up also, even though it's um, smaller, it's $5 for the little bottle, and um, yeah, $6 for the big one, 5 for the little gray one. Next, I have the Rosanna Naturals Curl Spray. I love Rosanna Naturals products. Um, the curl spray in particular is amazing. It is so easy to detangle your hair once you've sprayed it in there. I think I have some more things here from Rosanna also. So shampoo with um, sugarcane and almond. Oh, this is so good too. Very cleansing, but at the same time, it gives you moisture, okay? It gives you slip. Yeah, it's really, really good as a shampoo. So that one's a great one. And another one I have from Rosanna Naturals here. This one is the Shea Butter and Hibiscus Leave-In Conditioner. Okay. This leave-in is moisture rich, okay? I'm talking serious moisture. I love the full Rosanna Naturals line. Um, you know, it's just great. It's great all together because it gives you that amazing moisture. Um, I use it in a couple different ways, like for my twists. And then um, another kind of style that I do, it's a little bit hard to explain it exactly. I'll have to just make a video of it one day. But um, anyway, I use Use the full line I do like my full wash day and then um, I put everything on my hair I leave it in there in kind of a sleek low ponytail and after that it is just packed with moisture 
after about, I don't know, maybe three days, four days of leaving it in that low pony, I take out the ponytail holder and it just gives me a really good look. Again, I don't know how to explain it. I'm not doing a good job, but it just gives me a really good kind of a cute bob look to my hair once I take out that ponytail holder. But the moisture is serious, okay? Really good. All right, a couple Sultanicals products here. So this is a really good combination for doing um, protective twists. I don't often use this variety of the Knot Butter. I use just the um, regular Knot Butter one, not the Sprout one, but um, that combo gives me a great uh, long-term twists. I don't usually use it for twist outs, but just for when I want to have nice moisturized twists. They will be seriously moisturized. They will last a long time. Yes, that combination is perfect for that. But again, when I take out the twists, sometimes it's just not the best result. So I use other things if I actually want to do a twist out after having in my long-term twists. But the combo works pretty good. All right, Main Like Me Hair Pudding. I used this pudding quite a while ago and then I bought it again just to kind of see how it would do with my hair. Um, and it was good. It's not like my favorite, favorite product, but it is a good product, good company. Um, they have a good line of items, but I just have some other favorites. You know what I mean? <laughs> Okay, I picked up this one at um, Marshall's and it was $8. So this is the Curls Dynasty Pumpkin Mint Deep Treatment. It did work fine. Um, good deep conditioner. Really, I bought it because I know this brand. Um, good company and all of that. And it was a pretty good sale, you know, having it for $8 there. So I did pick it up just because I needed one. I would buy it again, but I'm not like in a hurry to do it or anything. Again, I'm kind of lessening how many products I use, but this did work. Here's the Jerry Naturals Aloe Vera Wash. Okay, guys, this Aloe Vera Wash, um, I can't even explain the slip on it. It is the best out of the world slip ever. I mean, the best the best moisture also and it cleans your hair now it's not a stripping cleanse it's truly a co-wash right but it is so so good i really really love it and i just randomly picked this up to try it so i was super surprised how good it was all right here are a couple shower lotions from annabelle's perfect blend Again, this is another one of her good products. It's so smooth and silky as you put it on your skin. After your shower, you feel like you glisten. You know, it's just a really, really good one. The scent's all great. Again, pick your favorite. This is Annabelle's Cleansing Conditioner, um, excuse me, the Ayurvedic Conditioner. And this is a really good co-wash. It has some really good ingredients in there. Great Ayurvedic product that gives me slip, it gives me moisture, it's a good one. So I really like using that co-wash. Here are a couple of the Rishi brand teas that I've been using, Matcha Super Green and the Elderberry Healer. Um, I do tea rinses after I've done my wash day. At the very end, I will usually use some sort of tea rinse. So this is just a couple examples of um, two that I've used. This is kind of a fancy brand, but I've definitely used, you know, just your regular old tea bags too and perfectly good. So here, this one's from um, Camille Rose. Clearly it's a pillow pack. So I've used this one for traveling. It works great. You guys know this brand. <laughs> All right, guys, this is the Grace Alea Slap Caps. All right, so I buy a lot of these satin lined caps because I use them often. Um, I use them to sleep in. I use them if I'm going out during, doing errands while I am deep conditioning. Maybe if I'm just wearing protective twists and I want them covered. 
I'm using my slap, okay? They are perfect, and I always buy mine in gray. The other colors are cool too. I've bought a couple of those, but I tend to always buy gray now. So yeah, I use these all the time. Always, always love them. This is the Coil Sculpting Custard from Miel. All right, so this paired with the leave-in from this line, amazing. I will show you. This is what I have in my hair right now, and the curls are just lovely. They have hold, they are defined, they're shiny. Um, I only recently took out the twists um, that I did with these two products here, and they look great. Guys, I forgot to mention I had one more from Rosanna Naturals. Um, this is moisture rich too. All of her products, moisture rich. Love it, love it, love it. Awesome moisture from this moisturizer. So yeah, I love, love, love her complete line, okay? But this one is specifically the Mango Butter and Argan Whipped Daily Hair Moisturizer. Here are a couple more body washes, one from Trader Joe's and the other from Etenio. So I already talked about Etenio before. Um, this is another one of their body washes, the one in the sorrel scent. I loved it, such a rich scent. But yeah, this one was from quite a while ago. I finished that up. And this Refresh um, body wash, I think I've mentioned this a few times. It is cheap, available at Trader Joe's, and I love the orange scent. I will certainly repurchase. All right, and lastly, my favorite go-to product. This thing is always in my life. Um, the oil and gel from She Sent It. I use this thing, you know, it'll be like multiple times in a week when I need to use it. So if I'm having a bad hair day and I need to put my hair, you know, up in a puff or something, I will sleek it back with this. Um... If I just want to have a normal sleek low ponytail or a low bun or something, I will sleek it back with this. All right, guys, that's it. Short and sweet. So, yeah, again, I am still natural, always, forever, no turning back. Um, I'm still using some products, purchasing a couple of things, um, being selective with that, I guess. And then... And the other half of me is using my DIY products. So yeah, things have been going good so far. I'm trying to simplify how many products and things I have and I'm using. So that has been a great positive so far. But that's it. I will see you guys around.